It's game day, Seminole fans. On a Friday, make sure you get out there and support your Noles. Lane Hurt, Tim Lenefelt here with you with your keys to a Seminole victory, starting with number one, take care of the short week. Florida State's already had it once this year with the Ole Miss to Charleston Southern. Now, they got back late after NC State, had to rearrange their practice schedule a little bit. It's very important how they handle the short week. I think this is a case where you want some of the veterans on your team, Demarcus Walker on the defense, Davin Cook, Roderick Johnson on the offense, to sort of take the lead in practice, make sure everybody is, is sharp, everybody's focused, everybody's paying attention, because you know, quite frankly, the, the time that Florida State had to prepare this week was shortened. So you, you had to combine your Monday and Tuesday into a day, and you had to combine your Tuesday and Wednesday into a day, and on and on and on. So, uh, you know, Florida State's not going to have the benefit of a full week of practice. You have to overcome that and, and be good in spite of it. At key number two, there's really two ways that Boston College can have a chance in this game, and the first one is our second key, and it's turnovers. You cannot give Boston College a short field by turning the ball over. Florida State has to protect the ball in this one. Yeah, look, Boston College has an outstanding defense and an offense that struggles, so it's, it's not exactly hard math. Uh, if, if you turn the ball over, the only way that offense is going to score points consistently, I think, is if they get a short field, and the only way they're going to do that is if you mess up either in turning the ball over or mess up on special teams. So take care of those things. You're probably going to be in pretty good shape. And then the second way Boston College can win is our third key, is eliminate trick plays. Don't fall for those. Obviously, Boston College needs needs to move the ball in chunks. They're not going to drive 15 plays down the field on, on Florida State. They need to pick up chunks. Trick plays is the way they like to do that. You got to have great eye discipline. Well, and look, especially late in the season, you, you already have, have had a year where things haven't gone your way. You're on the road. Everything's against you. You really don't have anything to lose. So why not dial into the bag of tricks, see if you can draw something up, and maybe it works. And then maybe it's an uncomfortable game in the fourth quarter. Who knows? All I'm saying is everything has to be on the table for, for Florida State to defend because I don't think you can rule anything out when you're playing a team that's in Boston College situation. There you have it, Seminole fans. There's your three keys to a Florida State victory this Friday night. Make sure you stick with us all game long. And post game, Tim will have his analysis. I'll have your highlights, your video reaction, and reaction from Jimbo Fisher and players as Florida State takes on Boston College. So for Tim, I'm Lane. Go Knowles.